Most of you remember uh, Greg and Vicky from the uh, 2011 V6 Mustang. They were one of the first ones in Knoxville to have it. And uh, he comes walking across the parking lot today, I didn't even recognize him. I said, well, what are you into? Greg, what are you into? Uh, I'm into my Harley now. You bought a Harley? Yeah. Still got the Mustang? Still got the Mustang. That's good. So you got two toys now. Got two little toys now. What'd you, what'd you end up buying? Uh, this is a uh, 2010 uh, Heritage Softail. Uh, I got it from Smoky Mountain Harley Davidson. Yeah. Uh, back during Veterans Day, uh, went over there basically just for the lunch and for Veterans Day, and wound up coming out of there with a Harley. <laughs> That's why they were feeding you lunch. That's it. It was something they in the Coca Cola. Sweeten up the ride That's there. That's right. Huh? So you spent a lot of time on it? Uh, a little bit so far, just uh, since the weather's come out, I've started getting out on it a little more. But sure. uh, winter time, had time to uh, put a little bit of stuff on it, uh, sort of. Uh, Making my own personal ride with a uh, Willie G stuff. Yeah. Uh, the air cleaner. The. Uh, yeah. Let's take a look at it. Show me sure, around. Show sure. me what we got going on. Uh, yeah, I got this. It's got the chrome kit on it. It's uh, got the highway bars. Uh, that's the Willie G's uh, symbol there. I like that. Oh, they're yeah, bound here the, too. Uh, six speed. Yes. Yeah, it's a six speed. Wow. And yeah, put the uh, Vance and Time uh, slip-ons on it. Yeah, we'll have to get you a start. A little more sound to it there. Because they're not, they're, they're too quiet they're from the factory. They're too quiet from the factory, <laughs> yeah. You want somebody to notice you when you come up to They a, say that's a, a safety a, thing. That loud pipe saves lives. That's what say. they say. That's it. And them bags, them are some, some uh, good yeah, looking those, bags there. Uh, bags are the factory bags, but I put a, uh, what they call a saggy bag kit in them. Okay. It keeps them from uh, collapsing. Right. Uh, basically, they have a uh, hard plastic. Oh, that's cool too. They got quick release instead of that buckle. Quick, quick releases, wow. sort of mounted into the top here. Yeah. And then it goes all the way down through the, the sides here. Oh, that's Keeps nice. It from, uh, from and it matched the seat too. Yeah. Did you put that seat on or is that already oh, this there? Is, uh, everything's uh, factory on it except for the Willie G uh, M's that I put on it. Uh, basically, just the way I bought it, I had the uh, luggage rack. I put the uh, little tool pouch up on the windshield. Yeah. And uh, you got the Willie G gas cap there. Willie G gas cap. Got the, uh, the leather insert here for it. All right. Got a uh, Willie G on the back of the sissy bar here. Look at that. And I also cool. uh, blacked out both my front and rear lights with the Willie G. I like that. That's your brake light. Yeah. Or one of them. No, it's actually a running light. A running light. Cool. And the white walls were they already on it. White walls was already on it, and the uh, the eighty spoke uh, chrome spoke wheels. No nope. good. So those, the so those uh, primary over here too, also. Oh yeah, yeah. Here. Look at that. Sweet. Yeah, that is a good looking bike. Of course, you keep it nice, like everything you got. Yeah, keep it, this one actually stays in the basement, so it's out of the weather and. I like those mirrors too. Oh, they got Willie G on them. Yeah, yeah. I, I changed the uh, those out. That is sweet. And I put the uh, Willie G's on the front axle nuts. See, that's what I want to become. I want to be able to buy my product and then go out and buy more of my product with a, my picture on it, right? That's it. That man's. They've done a good job of marketing. That's for sure. Get them started up here for us. Vicky, I appreciate that. <laughs> These folks back here don't they appreciate, didn't appreciate it. it but, <laughs> <laughs> but, but I appreciate it. Well, Greg, I pretty, I'm glad to see you back out this uh, summer. Yeah. Spring has sprung and uh, we're on our way. Oh, so definitely. Please, please be careful, but enjoy it. Oh, I will. I will. Have, a, have heading, a good day. Actually, heading this uh, next Saturday to uh, Pillissippi State for the uh, uh, advanced riders course. Oh, okay. Uh, basically, gets you more familiar with your bike, uh, gives you uh, like slow speed maneuvering. Yeah. Really helps you out a lot. I really suggest it to anybody that's either been riding for a long time or hasn't rode in a long time and decided to start riding again. Yeah, that's the case with you, I'm guessing. You went yeah, a while without riding. I, I rode 25 years ago. Right. It's been 25 years since I've had one, and so I'm getting back out on one and uh, really need to know the uh, rules of the road again and 
there's well, a, lot more, a lot more vehicles out now. Well, not only that, is you know, when we were kids, we all rode, you know, and we yeah. think, well, I didn't forget how to ride, but yeah, you do, you know, right. and uh, until you get some miles back up under you, sometimes it's good to get something like that. What's a Definitely. what's a, a class like that cost? A uh, class like that is ninety five dollars. Oh, it's an all day class. Uh, starts at eight o'clock in the morning, goes until uh, five o'clock in the afternoon. Sweet. And you, uh, if you didn't have your license, uh, they also do that. It's like two hundred forty. I think it's two hundred fifty dollars or two hundred twenty five dollars. If you want to get your license, it's a Saturday and a Sunday class. Wow. And at the end of it, you get the uh, certificate with stamp. Go out out to the DMV and get your uh, you know, stamp on your license for motorcycle. Oh, so they give you the test and everything? Yes. Oh, that's the way to do that. You got, and you use their box on that part. Oh, no kidding. Yeah. Wow. All you need is a helmet, gloves, uh, ankle high boots, and uh, you know, long pants and long sleeve shirt or, right. or a jacket. Right. Wow. Well, that's so, the way to do it. Even if you don't have a bike, you can go get your license. Right. Cool. Right. And they also have three wheeler classes too. For the spiders. For the spiders and the uh, the three wheeler uh, other bikes. Right. Right. Yeah, the trike. Right. Huh. Yeah, the all right, well, brother. I sure appreciate all the info. You too. Have fun. All right, Thank Scott. you. Bye bye. Bye. Folks, there you go. If you uh, if you're looking, I bet your town has something like that too. You know, where you can go out and get your license, and uh, you know, then you can decide whether you want to actually get a motorcycle. But uh, if you go on vacation, want to rent one or something, that might be a good idea. So, anyways, thanks for tuning in.